All right, guys, today we are going over the coordinate plane guided notes. My learning target for today is I can identify locations on a coordinate plane and graph ordered pairs in all four quadrants. A coordinate plane is a grid created by two number lines that intersect or cross at the origin. And we will talk about what the origin is in a little bit. On a coordinate plane, there are two number lines, and we give them a name of an x-axis and a y-axis. The x-axis is the horizontal axis, and the vertical axis is called the y-axis. So if I go down to the coordinate plane, this is the x-axis, this is the y-axis. The origin is the point where the x-axis and the y-axis intersect or cross. So that is right here. We will talk about ordered pairs in just a second, but the ordered pair for the origin is 0, 0. All the x values are positive to the right of the origin and negative to the left of the origin. So positive to, oops, positive to the right of the origin, negative to the left. And then when we are looking at the y values, they are positive above the origin, negative below the origin. An ordered pair is a point's location on the coordinate plane. When you see an ordered pair, the X is the first number and the Y is the second number. So sometimes you may be asked to graph a point or you may be asked what is the ordered pair for a given point. This actually should be a comma. I'll fix that typo on the original notes. All right, on a coordinate plane, it is divided into four quadrants. And I will show you that on the coordinate plane down here. So it says label the different parts of the coordinate plane. We are going to label the x-axis, the y-axis, the origin, and then all four quadrants. So we have the x-axis here, we have the y-axis, x, y, then we are going to label the origin, The ordered pair for the origin is zero, zero. And now we're gonna label the four quadrants. So something I remember to this day that my high school math teacher told me is when you are labeling the quadrants on a coordinate plane, you make a shape of a C, starting with quadrant one, two, three, four. So I'm going to write this on the bottom.
All right, next we are going to try graphing these ordered pairs. So A is at negative 1, 4. We need to remember that X is the number that is first, and then its Y location is the number that is second. So we are going to go over to negative 1 on the X axis and up to positive 4 on the Y axis. So this is where my point's going to go. Then for B, we're going to go over to positive 3 on the x-axis and up 2 on the y-axis. For point C, we're going to go to positive 4 on the x-axis and negative 3 on the y-axis. And then for our last point, D, we're going to go negative 1 on the x-axis and then negative 2 on the y-axis. All right, guys. Thanks for watching.